what is going on youtube first i want to give a shout out to everybody who is subscribed to the channel and a special shout out to these subscribers right here and if you want to pause the video and check them out man shout out to everybody who is rocking with your boy we have been blowing up on the channel lately and it's time to go all the way y'all know what time it is your boy drew and here we go again man let's get into it It's your boy Drew, and I'm doing a voiceover. This was my first game playing. <laughs> I, this was my first game playing, man, and oh my goodness, man. My first impressions are crazy. Uh, it's no telling when this video going to come out on YouTube, but I played the game, and it's, it's it's it was all right. It was all right. I enjoyed the game a whole lot more than I even expected to enjoy it. And I think I'm going to make it a point in the channel because I did a few live streams and things like that. And, oh, man, it, it's just crazy. I just can't wait, man. If y'all don't know, I'm live streaming Saturday, uh, which is tomorrow, um, of when this video is coming out. And we're just going to be playing with subs, man. I don't know if there's a lot of streamers on here just playing with their subs like I am. So let's do it, man. Let's get into it. So my first impression in my review of the game is that the game has so much potential and it has so many problems the hit detection in the game is just one of the problems that always stick out of mind like you can feel like you're behind something but you aren't maybe it's because i was streaming but even when i'm not streaming it feel like i'm behind something i know y'all had that same thing happen you feel like you're behind something and on the other person's screen you're not even behind anything it looks like they kill you clean but on your screen, you didn't even see them. And I, and it happens a lot. It happens a lot. The reload glitch is real. I hit reload. Look. It, oh, my God. Hit reload. Why didn't I reload? But anyway, the reload glitch is real. They need to go ahead and patch that. I, I, I think they will. I mean, this is the first week of the game being out. And with a lot of mobile games, there's going to be a lot of patches. And when come when they patch one thing, it's going to cause another problem. So just know that I've, I've been a mobile gamer for a long time. I'm um, playing different games and stuff like that, and I think it's time for me to get back into mobile gaming. But at the same time, I haven't forgot my PlayStation guys. I haven't forgot my um, PlayStation guys at all. I'm still gonna be doing my PlayStation thing. Red Dead Redemption videos are still coming, and uh, I, and and the Frontline game mode I didn't really understand. I was just shooting at this guy. Don't know why um, he didn't die, but I don't know if it's because he was in his quote unquote invisible stage or not. But I'm still learning the game, guys. I'm still learning the game. It's only my third day playing I, I, I've been a player since the launch I know a lot of people have been playing since um, the game first came out and they're playing on the Indian service and things like that I haven't been playing on no service so I'm very new look at me cheesing man just cheesing now I run out of ammo right here and I throw my little and boom gotta love it I don't know why the other guy didn't die he should have and I'm mad right now because I don't have any ammo but it's okay I just pull out the old knife, man. Only use my knife. La, 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 la. Only use my knife. Boom. Hit him with the smooth move. All right. But let's go to the good things. What I like about the game, I like the way they set up the aiming and things like that. They made it easy for people like me who haven't played a lot of first-person shooter mobile games to easily adjust. I adjusted very, very fast to the game. It didn't take no time for me to adjust. Um... All I had to do was press the button to aim down sight for me, and it was easy like that. It also has auto-aim in the game for people who just struggle completely. But I, I don't really like the auto-aim, man. Auto-aim is, eh. Like, what if I didn't try to shoot at somebody because they was on the other side of the map, you know, and now I gave away my position. You can always use a suppressor, but at the same time, the, um, the red markers when you get hit let you know somebody's shooting at you or something like that. So... Uh, I don't like the auto. I don't like the auto aiming. But uh, as for multiplayer, as for leveling up and things like that, I think it's good. I'm leveling up pretty good in the game. The battle pass looks pretty good. It got boxes and things like that. If you buy the battle pass, I'm thinking about getting a battle pass. So comment down below if you want me to get a battle pass, and I can kind of do a review and stuff for that. But uh, I, as of right now, I do not have the battle pass. But um. Also, in this game, I forgot to say, in this game, I, I went 29. I had got 29 kills. I'm not sure how many deaths I had, but I had 29 kills. And I felt good about it at first, but I really should have went like 50 and 0. <laughs> I really should have went like 50 and 0. I had every single kill in this game because now that I think about it, the beginning is so easy. It's so many people like you who are just noobs at the game. 
And that's what I like about the game. Like, when you first start out, the game makes you feel good. <laughs> The game makes you feel pretty good. Like, it has you playing against these noobs and you just knocking them left and right. Boom, shaka, boom. And you hitting them with the, you know what I'm talking about, moves. You know what I'm saying? And I'm getting hyped. I'm hitting my signature um, hitting my signature uh, words. I'm hitting the faux show. If y'all ain't know, I like to say faux show. And that's what I'm talking about. Those are like <laughs> my favorite things to say. And I'm just hyped doing this whole thing. I couldn't. I didn't uh, record it with my computer set up, I recorded it with my phone. So that's the reason why I'm having to do this voiceover and not giving my live reaction, you know what I'm saying? But I'm giving you my first impression. I think the game is pretty good overall, but it has problems, man, it has problems. But patches and things like that, this thing about these mobile games, patches and stuff can come out a whole lot faster um, than on console, but I, I, I think the game is good. It's in a good state. Uh, pubs, you better watch out. The only thing about it, I've heard the rumor that the the um, the battle royale is that somebody told me that there's just bots in there. I think they just true. I think they just trolled me. But in terms of bots, in terms of bots, he probably meant like, oh, it's just easy players in there. And that's probably true. A lot of people like the battle royale mode, and right now it's a lot easier to play that than the PUBG battle royale mode. Cause Pub PUBG is just battle royale only. I think a lot of people enjoy. The multiplayer in this more than the battle royale. Yeah, I don't know, man. Com comment that down below as well, man. Do you enjoy the multiplayer better than the battle royale? Or are you a battle royale guy on Call of Duty Mobile? I feel like battle royale is more for PUBG. Um, in terms of a more competitive thing, and that is very true. But COD Mobile having battle royale at lunch, I think that's very impressive as well. Look at that. Oh, get down to the ground. Get, oh, my goodness. I was feeling so good about myself. And I, look at that. I know. I'm just playing against a whole bunch of whole bunch of noobs. And this this was like after the tutorial. So these are real people. But they, they noobs just like me. Like, they, they not good. They, they not good at all. They probably like so new to the game. And like I said, I, I didn't really, I haven't really played a lot of first person shooters on my phone before. I played, I forgot, I even forgot the name of the game, but. It was a game I played like a couple of times, but I was so bad, I was trash, so I didn't, I didn't even touch that game no more. It wasn't even worth me playing it because I already knew that <laughs> I wasn't gonna get no kills on. It. I think I might have got a couple of kills and just quit. It was like no, it was like no, and I had a bad phone and my phone couldn't even support playing. And look at me getting that last kill like a boss, but my phone couldn't even support me playing it. It was bad, but all in all, man. Like I said, first impressions are great. It's a lot of bugs that need to be fixed. But I give this game right now as it stands as a mobile game definitely an eight and a half. It would get a perfect ten, but you gotta fix the glitches. <laughs> gotta fix the hit detection. You gotta fix the glitches and the hit detection. But we, I know they'll clean that up, so it is what it is. Comment down below your favorite game mode. And um I also want to say this, man. Thank you to all my new subscribers who follow me because of Call of Duty Mobile. I just want to say thank you. Also, shout out to everybody who be in the live streams. And if you have not caught a live stream, you got to come in that thing. Until next time, y'all know who it is. Your boy, Drew. And I'm out. Y'all have an amazing one. And keep grinding.